Second day. You stop playing. What? Oh, you I stop playing. I do get paid to suck. No, you don't. Not human, dude. But like what? But like what? Stick to my master class. I said more. <laughs> you know what? A little, you do what? A little mouth mask. You put your mouth on things and make them go, mm. mm. <laughs> they talk back. Okay, bet. I'm not talking about it. I mean, I don't know if the world is ready. But I mean, what kind you of you being a trailblazer? What kind of black market you. would we be if we didn't have no, you know, Coach. grown people stuff in there? We you gotta ready? have something for the adults. Are you ready? I put the kiddies to bed. <laughs> and put the kiddies to bed. We got a freak in the building. Would you? What would you describe it as? Is it a freak? Or is that too mild for you? I don't think I'm freaky. I'm just thorough. You thorough. Don't do it. We're gonna do it right. Okay. I see you bought a lot of equipment and things of that nature. No, this ain't nothing. This ain't nothing. All right, Dad. You gonna put this on you? I you know. No, I no. My freedom means way too much to me. Yo. <laughs> I put it on you. I put it on you, but I, you not put it on me. You gonna know how to do it? You I gonna am be sure the. You gonna I, walk you I am the man. Yeah. I am the man. Ain't no way you're about to put that sure, on my sure. hands, cause uh, <laughs> how I'm gonna reach my dick, I gotta rub it all up on the clip. Yeah, I can't I know it. do it without no hands. You gotta understand, baby, cause I'm the man. I need both hands and both wrists so I can grab them tits like this, like a dinosaur. You ain't never seen a nigga like me before. Use both hands in my neck and then slap myself with that tit. I'm just playing. I, I will, though. I will. I will. I, sometimes I just like to put both titties on my head. And just... That's how it be. That's how I'm living. I, I don't have no shower rod with some other. This is this shit. That's hella disrespectful. This is hella sturdier than a shower rod. I'm just saying. That just look like some shit that Jeffrey Epstein them had. <laughs> Don't mess it up for everybody. They I'm might want to use this. What is that called? A spreader bar. A spreader bar. I'm going to show you how you can use mm, mm. That shit caught me off guard. <laughs> I thought it was, I thought it had it. All right, well, look. Uh, I don't know if y'all heard, but the black market is over, OK? All right. OK. OK. This is enough. Put this up, man. No, I need, I'm gonna need this. I can tell. This is gonna be different. Because, I mean, we can't have a black market if we don't have anything to sell in there for the adults. Right? We, we must do that. How you feel about it, J-O-N? It's pretty interesting. Because <laughs> I'm tired of people asking me all these questions about how to improve their sex life. I'm not a sex bird, but she is. We got Miss Samaya Burton in here with us today. Now, we don't know everything, but she is a specialist in this field right here. Let me tell you some of the shit she be doing. Hold on, because I don't want to mess the name up. Jay Wynn, have you ever heard of a mouth master class? She has a, a sex condition and workout that will get you in shape to ready to have sex. It's just, just you have sexual stamina. You ain't shit to run, you ain't gonna be athletic, but you can have some good sex. <laughs> <laughs> so you've been really out here helping people have better sex. First of all, welcome to the trap. I just Thank wanted you, my audience to have, you know, privy to this information that you are providing, the service in the community. You have brought some of your 
teaching materials. Some teaching materials. Look yeah. how Marvin Gaye looking at your teaching materials. Marvin looking. He trying to see what's up. All right, what, 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 what is it? He from the Harry Pussy playlist time. Oh, my Lord. You know, since so a different time. I made you playlists. You know about the Harry Pussy? Yes. That's a whole nother show, though. All right, all right. The cups say pussy juice. Is it actual pussy juice you're drinking? That ain't none of my business. <laughs> what we got over here on this table? First, how you doing? I'm well. How you doing, man? I'm good. All right. I see business is doing well. Business is great. Okay. People, people opening up. You know, COVID had folks locked in the house. Right. And uh, there were some realizations that, okay, I'm locked in the house. These people, I think we need to do something new, something a little better. Spice it up a little Spice bit. Spice it up a little bit. Okay. And that's where you come in. That's why I come here. I hope people have better sex, have good sex. Crazy. Do you watch them or you just like critique them? I mean, like you ain't listening to shit I said, huh? <laughs> <laughs> a little yeah, bit of You're being your own self again. <laughs> a little bit of both. Did so, people actually ask you to watch them? And... People ask a lot of things. I get a lot of videos and they're like, hey, girl, I use what you show me in the dick sucking class. And, and look, see, it, it's, and I was like, all right. Oh, OK. It's not that. I thought women just naturally knew how to suck dick good. Do everybody suck your dick good? No. All right, then. I see why you the teacher. <laughs> I see but no, why you the teacher. Everybody talks about, like, women be faking orgasms, but I don't think that we really discuss that men, just because men catch a nut doesn't mean it was a good nut. Nope. I was trying to teach them the difference that. between busting a nut and having an orgasm. Oh, for men, that's, that's yeah. two different things? Yeah, yeah. It's what two is totally busting different. a nut, like masturbating, but inside of somebody? No, you bust a nut, you just, ah, it's a nut. Oh. You have effect in that? Yeah. You spit on their back? No, nah, just get the fuck out of there. <laughs> get the fuck out of there. What you do? do you... I, I, look, shoo, woo. That was great? Not at all. All right, women be faking nuts, men be faking nuts, you That's know? Fine. And uh, so we got stuff to learn, different stuff. That's cool. You think men have a problem with women faking orgasm? No. I think that they avoid the conversation because don't nobody want to really know. It's like, as long as I don't know, I ain't really got to address it. I just think it's cool that they care enough to fake it sometimes. That's cool. That really says a lot because if she's faking it, she probably really like you. What if she have a real one and then she just throw you an alley with the fake one? Like, Actually, this is what usually happens. <laughs> so, <laughs> like she give you a real one like, oh, uh, oh, uh, oh, uh, and then she give you like a fake one that's beautiful. Like, <laughs> She just mix it up. Like, the real ones ain't sexy at all. Oh, 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 you're a fool, you're a fool, you're a fool, you're a fool. But you gotta stop breathing. You're breathing too much. You know when people catch the real nuts, they... That's how they end up pooping. Most women have a real organ have them poot a little bit. So you ain't just got gassy? A little poot slip out. Yeah. All right. You still was fucking though, right? Yeah, man. Yeah. That's, that's how a nigga know. Like, she can't fake that. That's a poop. <laughs> That's real. You can't fake a poop. Yeah. All right, now look. So a lot of women come to me because they've never had an orgasm, period. OK, let's discuss that. Why do you think that is? A lot of people don't know how to play with... Nope. Nobody sat us down and showed us how to play with our pussy. Really? Nobody sat us down, neither showed us anything right. about this dick, just how to clean it. D barely. D you know what? That's not I keep my, my dick clean enough to put in some... All right, whatever. What is that? A clitoris. I thought this was squirrel lungs. <laughs> <laughs> My it's bad. It's a clitoris. It's a clitoris. You sure? I'm t are you sure? Are we going there? No. <laughs> All right. So this is a coochie, right? And this is what everybody usually sees right here. They, yep. The clit, right? You see the little hood, you know, the little skin, like if it's a if it's a fat one, you know, like you gotta kinda raise the skin up, the hood up to get to the clit. But that's just this part. It's just the tip of the iceberg. This entire thing is the clitoris. And so if you were looking up under the skin, these legs, all these legs, they lay up under here. And just this is this part. Just that. Is you picking up what I'm putting down? Yeah, keep going. All right. I didn't know the pussy had some lungs in it. It got all that shit. So, so the skin, this clitoral hood is super sensitive. You can make women orgasm from that. 
But ultimately, the reason that sometimes the orgasm is weak or it doesn't happen is because all this blood flow is filling all this up and they get bigger. So you ever put your finger in somebody like after y'all messing around and it's like, damn, this shit talk like my finger can't fit? Cause she get, she going, it's swollen. It's swollen. So when you hear like, oh, it feel like I threw a hot dog down the hallway when you fucking, that's cause she not aroused, she not done yet. When these are swollen, you could barely stick a finger in here. All right, but it don't be swollen. People be putting a dick into, into the pussy not warmed up, it's cold. You gotta preheat it. <laughs> oh, yeah, okay. Oh, okay. Yeah. I just didn't want to keep going. No, I'm you just, know what I'm I'm, this, this type of student I am. But oh, I mean, okay. I don't this, know what's on the test. You, look for you. Okay, so if you starting here, a lot of times the reason that the dick is going in too early is because people are having foreplay and they're not having it long enough. So what you think foreplay is? Like some kissing, some. Touching some pussy, right? Look, suck a little dick. Not me. <laughs> well, me. Uh, yeah, see, stay in your lane. Well, both. Don't you try know to put, what? I'm try like to put that lanes. shit on me. Look here. So, the problem is, there's to get to orgasm, you gotta have desire, arousal, orgasm, and then refractory period. It's four parts, right? But desire and arousal looks so similar for women. Like, they nipples hard, they wet, and so you're like, oh, she ready for this dick. But that she still just desires the dick. Just because her body responding in certain ways, it's not into this, it's completely swollen, and do do. You know, when your pussy start getting that heartbeat and it's really going, you know what I'm talking about? Yeah. And so that's when the pussy ready. That's when the pussy ready. But for y'all, y'all did get hard, and y'all like, all right, it's time. No, it's different times. Women need like 18 to 40 minutes to be fully aroused. You just turn it on 85 South Show, and when the episode go off, then you can stick the dick in. 18 to 40 minutes? 18 to 40 minutes. For y'all too, that's why some of y'all nuts be so weak. Cause like as soon as y'all stick, y'all like, y'all don't know how to sit in being aroused. Mm -mm. You're not aroused for long enough. Your blood not pumping. Like what's what's arousal? It's nothing but blood flow to your genitals. Yeah. And so when y'all be giving lackluster dick, it's cause that blood ain't really flowing. You ain't really wanna fuck. You kind of just bored. It's like. Mm. You're a good teacher. Keep going. <laughs> Keep going. <laughs> It's just your voice is so believable. I'm, I'm for real. Yeah, it sounds like you done watched everybody fucking. You know how everybody fucking right now. It's so you saying I'm telling some truths? I, I don't know. I don't know. All right. I did not. I did not know it took the pussy 18 to 40 minutes to be ready though. Yeah, you got to jumpstart that motherfucker. I didn't even. I probably ain't never had no done pussy though. <laughs> You know, I ain't never, I don't you know, know if I ever so, had nothing that was all the way done. So you know, like, one of the keys to having, like, great sex for women, see, men and women are different sexually, I know. right? I couldn't imagine trying to make her wait 30, 30 more minutes on this dick. Well, if you give her three nuts, the 30 minutes will pass by quickly. Hmm. If you can give her three nuts before you put your dick in, like, that's a surefire way to test that the grease is hot enough. You know how, like, when you're about to fry some chicken, you put a little water in, you just drip a little water to make sure it sizzle, if it don't sizzle hot enough, the grease ain't ready. You know what I'm saying? You need to put your tongue in there, just make sure, you know what I'm saying? So if you give her three nuts, before you put your dick in it, you know that it's warmed up. Okay. All right? All right, good. So you know, like, when you jump a car, you like cars. Yeah. You know. Yeah. So. This pussy need to jump. Okay, but you know how when you jump it the first time and it goes, uh, and you're like, dang. So then you say, hey, turn it over again, and then it goes, dun, dun. But that third time, it start up in the statement, like, all right, let's go, for it cut off again, right? Right. Yeah. Okay. Y'all yeah, be like, oh, it's wet, put my dick in. No! That shit, like, hey. Women are multi-orgasmic. Sounds what, like a lot of work. Too? Sounds like a lot of work to me, fellas. What? I didn't know this was just more shit we had to do. That's <laughs> It's stuff for her to do too. She want three nuts before you just over here with a hard dick and some pre-cup. 
<laughs> Y'all is selfish as fuck. I wish to. All right, go ahead. I'm just, I'm just saying. I'm like, just saying, too. Could you imagine, though, she get pregnant and she ain't even catch a nut? <laughs> <laughs> and baby gonna be average as fuck. <laughs> I'm just saying. Could you... C student. I'm just saying, like, <laughs> when you think about it from, like, oh, both sides, when you think about it from both sides, could you imagine, wouldn't you be pissed if you got somebody pregnant and you ain't even get to nut? It was just pre-nut, and she was like, never mind. <laughs> That's evil. That's I'm like, just, it's the same thing. We be having blue pussy, too. Like, we not done. For real. Stretch marks, titties sagging, got a breastfeed, and I ain't even catch my nut. Here. What do you mean? Yeah, communicate. Now it's communicate. communicate. It's a lot of work, but guess what? You know, it it'll be good. It'll be, right. be king dingling by the time I'm done teaching. <laughs> Keep going. <laughs> what else? What else? I've been right. I've been fighting out. I've been getting all this pussy that ain't always thought out. <laughs> <laughs> I be in the pussy about seven minutes. As <laughs> soon as it come out, minutes. I'm talking about as soon as it come out. I don't wait the same 40 song minutes. Be on I don't wait 40 pussy minutes. I be in, I be ordering pussy like a white man at the steakhouse. It's rare. Bring it, bring it. Let me see. No, I'm just like, oh, shit. Nah, you know women be sucking dick. The same song be on when she started and when she stopped. And y'all be the same way. Don't, don't blame all that on us. That's it's not, all, that's not, that's not all of us. Okay. So look, we got some there. toys to help. What's that? This is a Hummer. It's for your dick. Hey, I'm Carlos Miller. Some of you fellas have to be open and honest. Sometimes you fall short in the bedroom. I don't, but the guys that do, get you some Blue Chew. Blue Chew is a unique online service that delivers the same active ingredients as Viagra and Cialis, but in chewable tablets and at a fraction of the cost. First step is simple. Visit BlueChew.com, then consult with one of their licensed medical providers, and once you're approved, you'll receive your prescription within days. You can take them anytime, day or night, so you can plan ahead or be ready whenever an opportunity arises. So if you can benefit from extra confidence when it's time to perform, Blue Chew can help. And we've got a special deal for our listeners. Try Blue Chew for free when you use promo code BLACK at checkout. Just pay $5 shipping. That's BlueChew.com, promo code BLACK, B-L-A-C-K, to receive your first month free. Visit BlueChew.com for more details and important safety information. And we thank Blue Chew for sponsoring this podcast. Is it? Yeah. It's called a Hummer. It's called a Hummer. It works really simple. Look, watch this. Fellas in the room, have you ever seen this contraption before? Thank you. You see that? We don't even know where they sell them motherfuckers at. That might just be a one of a kind. This is how to create this. Hey. Boy, did you even know they sell pussy replicas? That's not the pussy replica. What is that? This goes on, so look, this is what you do. We make some squish squish, all right? You put some lube in here, or okay. some spit. It depends what y'all on. And then, here. Wait, you got the lube. You the lube master today. OK. Lube me up, OK? That's what she said. You know what I'm saying? Look, look. You know how to open it? You need help? I got it. All right. You making sure it's at the bottom like toothpaste? Yep. <laughs> fellas, when, <laughs> fellas, when you open in the lube, don't, always, don't open it all the way, because you ain't going to use all of this shit. Mm-mm. All right, put something up here. Size of a dime. That's what they say. See how much that is? All right, now, if that's all the spit she put on there, would that be enough? Ma'am, this is your demonstration. I'm just All here. right, no, for a friend. Dang, you didn't got it on that. I got lube, too. She was a squirter. But <laughs> I'm a squirter, Neil. All right, so what we do, here, let me stick this back to this. All right, so, oh, this is a thrusting machine, just so y'all know, all right? So this is what this do. All right, but anyways, we're just going to use this as a dick. You. We already here now. So you use this, we're gonna use this as a dick. Alright. All right. So you put this on here and touch it on the inside. See how soft it is? Wow. Wow. Alright. For all the people who wondered what it felt like, um, I don't even know how to describe it. <laughs> That's All right. The, go ahead. So when you put enough spit and lube in here, though, like he's giving you the... Here you go. You know what I'm talking about? I'll just use the rest of it. Thank you, friend. I got another pig, you know? Hello. You get it all in there. There's some right here in this corner. 
And all my toys come from black-owned vendors, okay? Okay. <laughs> Erotic Udar. All right, That's bet. Great. All right. So you buy that. All right, so you put it on here like this. So ladies, okay. like when they're doing the gawk gawk, you know, th you know. Mm -hmm. She supposed to just bust that out. And no, throw I'm saying it in you can do this it. instead, so that way, because a lot of people like how you supposed to last from 18 to 40 minutes. So use that. Yeah, you can help. Yeah. Like, like you want a lady to use that on a man? Yes. She gets to use her mouth. You don't want to eat pussy for more than seven minutes, but she's supposed to suck dick for 40 minutes. I didn't say I wasn't going to eat the pussy for more than seven minutes. <laughs> you going to eat the pussy for 40 I minutes? I said, you said how, lo how long it take the pussy to be ready? Uh-huh. About 40 minutes? Yeah. My, I said my cutoff is about seven. <laughs> so in correlation to what you were saying, I was saying this pussy is fresh out the freezer. <laughs> I ain't warmed up nothing, it's, apparently. It's not, but this going to help. But I'm just saying. This going to help. So Tell us, would you rather her suck your dick or use this? It's a helper too. Or both. Or both. See, we not why, even... why are you gonna knock it to you? Because I'm asking the men in the room, what would they like? I didn't say. We just, I don't know. Maybe this. All right. I'm just saying. Let's yeah, like, move. Get that plastic thing. Right, then you get. Then you getting just three minutes of dick suck. The same song still on, and okay. it's a short song too, a three minute song. She she already done suck your dick, okay. so she could you know suck some here, suck on the balls, and then you know here. Now when you put your finger over the top, it traps the air, and that's how you get the and it feel like suction. See, look there. Wow. <laughs> See. No batteries in that. Let me hit this blunt again. Ain't no more, friend. That's crazy. <laughs> <laughs> what and the... so she could do that, so she could switch when her mouth gets tired. You don't want her to get locked jaw on your shit. Wow, her mouth get tired. <laughs> she must really don't like dude. I'm just saying. So then, if <laughs> these are mouth... adults. Yeah, and then if your mouth gets tired, you can use a clitoral stimulator. So what is that? Let me see that. I have never saw this before. I thought this was a thermometer. Where it was going? I don't know. I thought you just check your temperature. With it. You, it, we've been in COVID too long. Oh, that's not. I thought this how you. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Are you going to see? Hold on. How you turn it on? Hold down the plus button. Did you hold it down? Yeah, it's on. All right. Now keep pressing it, and then it go up. She ain't gonna be able to take one more though. Look at you! See, you halfway there. All right. So what you do is now look. They I don't... think women would masturbate with anything. You could drive a motorcycle up to the pussy. Don't She'd let be me like, be locked. Ah. Don't, <laughs> don't let me be locked in somewhere. Look here, I'll figure it out. All right. That's crazy. So look, you take the toy. Okay. And you put it on the clip. Okay. Right. Look, they only sell them in this color, so, you know. When Can they... I get a set of those? That would be some nice coasters, like if we were at the crib. <laughs> <laughs> like if we were watching the game, like, hold on, nigga, get a coaster, get a coaster, nigga. <laughs> <laughs> Don't sit there and make a drink now, nigga. They got them coaster right there, okay, man. Okay, we got it, all right. <laughs> <laughs> okay, all right. show them how to put it on, on the jump. OK, so if this the pussy, it, wait, which one you want to use? You know it's different types of pussy. Which one you want to use? Use the one that's less socially accepted. Less want, socially accepted? We want everybody to be included. Just use, rotate them. Just show them rotate how to use them. Out. You know what you should do? You should show them how they work on all different ones. Fridge, you want a lot. Yeah, because all you vaginas all is not, not set the up same. the same. Friend ain't the same. I love all right, because let me give you the situation. All right. Say your girl got them lips like this, right? Like, so you, when you're doing mm -hmm. the clit shit, should you just, you said the whole thing, right? So should yes. you hit the lip too with the vibrator? Yes, you can Individual move it around. Individual lip so, or just both lips at the so same time? So the first three inches, like the entry of the vaginal opening, and mind you, this is the vulva. Right. The hole is the vagina. Right. Okay? Just That's like outside the club. Yeah. Can't even get in. Can't even get in. Can't even get in. All right, so right there at the entry is where it's like super sensitive. That's where like most of the nerve endings are. Like right like there that. in the club. Right there. There. Like right there, at the door. like that's the hot spot right, right. there. You okay. know what I'm saying? So putting your tongue there, putting your fingers there, and sometimes just even rubbing the lips like this help yeah. get that blood flowing. Cause once I go to fill this up with, you know, get it swollen, right? So all the movement, but also this clitoral hood part right here. 
which is the same thing as this part, sometimes this can make her orgasm alone. Right. Like sometimes just touching the clit directly is just way too, you know what I'm saying? It's too sensitive. It's too sensitive. It's too sensitive. Make a big toe crack. And that's okay. Hang on, That's how you that. know it's for real. If her big toe lock when up they like this. Yeah, big, it's the big one though. If it go like. That's how oh. <laughs> That's when you're on your grown man shit. So look here, you put it on here and you just kind of like move it around so you can find that sweet spot. But the reason I like this toy is because it's not super strong. So it's like, if your mouth come behind this toy, it's not like you competing like, you know, damn, that toy went first. I can't go yeah, after this. Cause it's like y'all a team. Yeah. You got the team working. All right. So, yes, but. So fellas need to stop looking at this shit as competition. Absolutely. And look at it as a tool. Some help. Yeah, Some help. it's just pussy tools. You show pussy up tools. and be like, hold on, I got my pussy drill on me. You, <laughs> just, you know what, you get one of them utility belts yeah, and just put them just all have in all the kind of shit. You know but I feel like, and most, I don't know, maybe it's just me. I feel like if, you, if a lady came over your house and you had all this shit already, she gonna leave. She gonna call everybody. She know I'm like, bitch, this nigga a freak. I don't know what the fuck. He got a dildo machine with a dick on it with a mouth, and I don't want to be. Oh, no. She gonna probably go to her truck and say, poor, I know he was in there. Hold on, let me go get my exactly. man. Exactly. Because you pull that shit out on me, that's what I'm gonna do. What's up? All right. What else on this table? What's on this table? Oh, this one. Oh. You through with this? Oh, let me, you want me to show you how to use? I, I'm gonna, you can do it on, your, on you. On me? Yeah. All right. You gonna have me on the couch. All right. So say. All right, you know what? In the name of learning. All right. All right. So it got straps and it's adjustable. I'm a little okay. smidget, so I'm a little short, so the, the, the thing is kind of short. Oh, All okay. right, we just go strap it around my ankles. All right. And I'm gonna give you a, this is called a spreader bar. A okay. spreader bar for real? That's the real name. Spreader bar, yeah. Ain't okay. not, it ain't rocket science, you know? Yeah. Simple name a spreader bar. A pry bar. All right. Ooh. Go help. All right. Okay, bet. If you fucking with somebody. Right and they laying down, right. you can use this as leverage. Like to hold yourself up. You ready, you ready. Okay, hold on. Make sure, don't lay back, cause your titty gonna fall out. All right, well, Just, you know what I'm I get, saying. I get what you you're get what saying. I'm saying, and you I... hold it. So, if you, hold on. Cause I don't, they can't see this on the ground. Yeah, they know what it is. So if you like this, fucking with somebody, and, and she laying she down. Spread and then Yes, her legs is wide open, right. okay? You like this, and now you can hit the stroke. And you can do your push-ups, too. All the things. Why you in there? Because that motherfucker's sturdy. Let me see. That motherfucker's sturdy. Yeah, you can get your shit together while you in there. <laughs> and then you can, cl you can clip this. this like yeah, you, you can, can hang this on yeah, the ceiling you can get and get other something. stuff and, and hook Ooh. it and dang So you telling me I can get two of these and have her, like... In the doorway, like... Like one of them Walmart chickens. <laughs> You know the chicken they said? <laughs> Hell, the hell, yeah. Like a Oh, yeah, I got an ass in there. <laughs> it puts almost done. It been up for 22 minutes. And then just spin it around. ass around. <laughs> yes. So, like, the arms could be up. So and like, it's adjustable, too. So, yeah. if your girl can go, if she flexible, you can yeah. go. You, hold on, let me mm. show you. Is, right. is it locked? Yeah. See, it's not, it's she not, look. it's not. Especially if your girl, Flimsy, you know what I'm if saying? your girl like six foot, her legs can open. What, boy? Can you do it this way? You think? Do whatever you want. You, if you figure it out. Put one leg right there. You know they got other toys. They got sex swings and things for that. You can't make one toy do. But everything. I'm saying you could just. I think you can go. If I'm just saying, can you? Get, it's a horizontal too. It vertical too. You can go both ways. Don't worry it's about the it. the interest. You gonna figure it out? I'm just holding All right, you're gonna report back. Let me know what you find I out. I think this go, go on. They should have put heights right here. Like if she oh, found five that. Foot yeah. Three. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That would actually be great. Yeah. Because taking it off and putting it back on because you're short is kind of awkward. But it's yeah. okay. But then they got the little joint. You can put the handcuffs right there, too. Yeah, we, I ain't bring that today. Yeah. 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 Everybody's yeah. saying handcuffs. They want to see something different. I know, but I'm saying, though, it's just the options. You want to hold that while we finish? Like, I'm just, you I'm hold done. It? I was just making sure. You seem sure like you like it. You want to hold it? Just see what brand that is, because that's, that's sturdy. That's yeah, real sturdy. sturdy. For real, for real. 
that's honestly a lot of people don't like sex toys because they using they not shopping at good they oh Amazon they seen the Amazon they're not getting quality it shit it's not and just because it's the same toy like it has the same name does not mean that it was actually supported by a good toy manufacturer right you know what I'm saying right it's like getting the base model of a car right yeah so this one is amazing. Now look here, these you gotta be prepared. Now look, first time I used this, I thought I was gonna, so it got the little suction cup, and you think you can use it in the shower. So I had a little, you know, me time weekend. I ended up having to put this shit on the mini fridge. It wouldn't stay. But I thought y'all said me and the fuck anything. This is a top, top well, You fucking toy. a sticky dick on the mini fridge. It's not sticky, it's suctiony. <laughs> So what had happened was, the shower didn't have a stick like I thought. And then I looked around the room, and there was nothing else. And I saw the mini fridge, and I was like, bitch, I mean, is you with it? Is you with it? And I was like, fuck it. You so I just adjusted, and then and you boom, and then you turned it on, and you just, you know. Well, you turned it on. I did turn it on. This yours, or that's one like it? Oh, this mine. Oh, OK. You just brought your shit, the shit yeah, you like. Yeah, some of the stuff that I, that, okay. you know. Keep going. Yeah. What else you got? So you can combine some shit together. Oh, you selling any of this shit? Today? I'm just saying for the people who watch Oh, it. you can go to erotic boudoir, erotic underscore boudoir, like on Instagram. Okay. You can use code sexual for a discount, but that's a trusted vendor that I like. I don't ever talk about nothing I've never used. Oh. Um, a lot of, not to be funny, but like a lot of black people don't fuck with toys because they be like, well, I bought this toy one time and it ain't work and da 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 da. And toys is expensive. So finding a good toy company is really great. Like, so if you tried toys before and it didn't work out, do it again. Do it again. Everything don't work on the first time, okay. you know? So I like this one. Right. We got some butt plugs. Oh, OK. Mm-hmm. You could spice up your nudes with it. Well, not your nudes. What? You could, sp wait. I was just thinking. I know. You know, you just put it in and then like bend over and then like clap your booty cheeks and send them a little gif for your booty cheeks. But then this is in there or this in there. Like That'll go good for Black History Month. Noted. It Why just that one just like that? Don't this just seem, that just screams Black History Month. It's just the black afro. I saw it as a bunny tail. I ain't gonna lie to I'm you. I'm just letting you know, I felt real pro-black. I'm just, I'm good. Okay. Yeah. I ain't put it in there. Oh. It's new. It's new. This, I ain't bring no booties, you know. Oh, okay. I'm just saying about some pussy coasters and shit. You like the pussy coasters? I do. I definitely want to plug on that. Pussy coasters? Yes, so. But that's like the handheld different. version uh -huh. of the sticky joint. Mm -hmm. So these are your favorite ones? Out of I nine mean, out of 10, how much would you recommend the ladies get one of these? 12. Absolutely, because you can I'm use at, this. Is that like, what? I, is that right? Hold on. Twelve out of ten for sure. I was saying one out of ten. What would you say? Twelve, man. Okay. You got like because look, you only can do so much, like by yourself. If you struggling Me? to put, yeah, anybody. Uh oh. You got two hands and you got a dick and you got some feet and don't nobody want them feet on them. So you, you this <laughs> all you got to work with. <laughs> what you into? <laughs> hey, I'm just saying. <laughs> So say you stroking, right? And you know y'all know that we like the clit touch, so y'all be rubbing, but when y'all, it's either one or two gonna be good. Right. The stroke either gonna be off if your hand is right, or the stroke gonna be good, but really you kind of DJing the shit, like, in incorrectly. So like, if you using your hand for this and you using your mouth here, now you got some accuracy, some precision. She won't have to pick between the good dick and the good clit, mm. you know? She can get both of them. Okay. So you can use this and use your mouth, or you can use this, and use this toy on her clit at the same time, have her squirting everywhere. Oh, so that's the type of shit you like. You I like, like you like this and some other shit. You I'm like shit with it. I want it all. Oh, okay. I just, I want to you see how You want to get overwhelmed? Go. Like, what's too much? I'm still alive, so I think I'm just good. saying, you don't never have to stop me like, hold on, wait, wait, wait. I right, bring it back, you know? Oh, okay. Maybe you just built for this. I just feel like if you die, you die. Damn. That's Just the mindset you go Put all my shit with? away, though. Put all my shit away. Nah, like, all this shit gonna be left out. <laughs> all, everybody know you got it, bro. I guess this is the grand finale. What the, what is this? That, oh, that's a fucking machine. I thought that was the shit that they cut the deli meat with. No. <laughs> <laughs> no. 
<laughs> I mean. All right, what is what is this? You want to hear you? You do it. That's the remote. This the remote. Well, it's a two, it's two purpose. This actually can go in their booty. Wow. And vibrate at the same time. <laughs> so like. So, I mean, oh, so you she uses okay. that. So you using this? Don't try to make it hypothetical. This is your shit. Absolutely. You gotta claim this. Absolutely. Now, so how look, do you use this? Now, I ain't gonna lie to you. I'm short, so this thing right here, it go down. Mine gotta go all the way down. Okay. <laughs> so, like, say if say I was fucking on the couch, all right? We would turn it around, and then you have an angle right here. You know what I'm saying? Oh. And so you sitting there, you know, the good energy, you know what I'm saying? Big, big energy. You would take the remote. I got the remote. Uh huh. So you see, doing your thing right and so there. I'm and over I'm, here like, and I'm ooh, over here yeah. just smoking the blunt like yeah, this. Yeah, I'm giving you a shot. You know what I'm saying? Like, ooh, ooh. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Hey, 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 hey. Right. Relax, man. Oh. Relax. <laughs> Relax, man. Everybody calm down. All right. We get. No, nah, she was talking shit earlier. <laughs> She said she, she shouldn't have bought this. And so, and so you get to take a break, you know what I'm saying? You get to watch a show. Like, how often do you get to watch your girl actually get fucked? <laughs> what if you get distracted, get to play the PlayStation, and you just, you over there, you ain't even looking. But, girl, you still over there? Oh, my oh, God. My bad, my bad. Hey, go lay down. See? Yeah, so that, ain't gonna that's... turn it all the way off, though. Girl, girl go to bed. <laughs> yeah, and so then, like, if you come over here, what you could do is you could take it and this, like, this vibrate, can vibrate too. It does. And then, you know the tick of the booty? Is know? it another remote for that, for that part? Like, what if you... Nah, it's a long string. It's a long... I suggest they get one more remote. That's cool that that's the remote. But if they had, like, like say she wanted to sit on it and you had another remote too, mm -hmm. now that'd just be all the way. And see, usually you probably wouldn't be this far away. You know no. what I'm saying? You'd be like right here. And so you had a remote and you could just sit there, but yeah, you can you can put it up higher and then she could stand over it. Like I said, oh. I'm five three. How long so did it take you to find thing. your angle? About three minutes. What this what is this setup run? You had to put it together yourself? Is it coming already some assembled like a very special person put it together for me. Oh. Got a riding machine, a sex bench, you know, everything. You got to assemble yourself, though. Now, where is you, in, at your home do you keep this contraption? In my office. Oh. It, when you walk in the room, though, it's so beautiful. The ambiance is amazing. You don't even realize there's dicks everywhere in there until you start looking and you're like, is that a dick lamp? It is. Mm. It is, you know. You have a lot of visitors and people just come. A lot of visitors. A lot of people don't. Um, oh, it's about see. Told you, vibrate. Oh. They don't do the family barbecues and stuff like at my place that much. Like. Now but, give me some more advice about what these fellas should do about you know these ladies who've never achieved an orgasm. Well, first of all, I think we need you to know, talk about outside eating pussy. of all the toys no, and no, things no, let's, like let's that. Let's get back to the basics. So okay. if we're talking about like eating pussy, okay. You know how Here's like. Use a different pussy. That one's been used. Oh. Oops. We're doing. Excuse what's us. all about diversity? All right. So we're gonna use a different one. Okay. You need a coaster mm. for your water. <laughs> uh, there you go. All right. So. Look, on the clip. <laughs> so, eating pussy properly. Okay. If I say, how do you eat pussy, a lot of people cannot tell me right. how they actually eat pussy. They're really down there like SpongeBob <laughs> and just doing shit. That'll work too now. No, it really doesn't. Just not saying. well. Okay? You probably catch them on them fake nuts. And also, you should not be wearing all your first week of school outfits on one day. So, if you know some stuff, some skills, some tricks, give us a second. Like, let it, like give it four to five minutes and then go on to the next thing. But Start with one thing and then you end up with something else. And so if you if transitioning I, too fast. Yeah, transitioning too fast. And so when I'm when I'm feeling it, it's like, okay, ooh, go back to that. But you don't know what you did because you was really doing a lot of things. Mm. And you don't know. Mm. Also, like stop responding to me not yelling and gyrating and shit. Nobody look, if I'm trying to catch a nut, I'm concentrating. I'm quiet. You know what I'm saying? Like a lot of people are like, well, you wasn't making is it about you or is it about me? Because when I'm, like, trying to catch a nut, I'm trying to breathe and remember. Like, you know what I'm saying? Like, when you're really catching a good nut and it's building, you know what I'm saying? It's real silent. Like, I feel, like, we, like, I feel like we're breaking up right now. 
I feel like I'm being reprimanded like I ate some pussy wrong. It wasn't, it wasn't I didn't me. say you, I'm just saying. I'm just saying like, the room got all still and what? Like if I'm focused, <laughs> and you gonna do shit you didn't do that you know that you didn't, I liked it. And I already made you wait 44 minutes for the pussy. And then you find some shit I like and just change the goddamn channel. I'm, I'm just saying. You need to say his name. <laughs> Clear your conscience. <laughs> So that's one. And then also just like turning the lights on too and just asking how, you know, she feel about it. Learning yeah. how to do a yoni massage is really great. I come out like a waiter and I be like, how you want this pussy? Yeah, uh -huh. okay, and, okay. All right. All right. <laughs> Licked all around? Hold the spit. All right, or no? all right, okay. Whole area. All right, yeah. Okay, cool. All right, I'll be right with you. <laughs> Go think on your notes yeah. and come back. Come back. So I teach this class, it's called, like, it's a yoni massage class, it's a three-part class. And it'll teach you, like, how to, like, ease the nut and, like, massage the nut up out the pussy. That can happen. Just... Yeah. I like, I can teach you, well, you might not want to learn how, but... What? Even learning, like, a lingam massage, that's a dick massage. Because so many of y'all and people just still jack dick like this. That's it. There's so many other ways that you could like jack dick and do Every different things. Every man in here has taken their dick back before. Taking it back? Yeah. <laughs> what? Get it? Get it? Get it? You stupid. You lost your privilege. <laughs> you're ignorant. That's what you are. You're real ignorant. <laughs> Don't fucking do nobody shit like that. I'm just saying, like it's just it's not working. Like it. <laughs> Look how they laughing. It's true. He like, they like, yeah. You know, every man is. What the fuck? Back. What is wrong with you? Uh huh. Get my drawers. Get my drawers. I'm, you know what? See, drawers. this is shit I'm talking about. Pull, I'm trying to pull my whole damn meat off. I'm just saying, it's a lot of different ways to get, like, proper arousal. So, like, in the beginning, when we were talking about 18 to 40 minutes, I feel like it sounded unrealistic and, like, damn, how the fuck we supposed to do that? Hell, we just, like, you could pick a thing and you really gotta, like, be a student to the pussy and, like, really zone in and be do any, ready to communicate. Do any of your clients, like, do women come in and be like, I don't know if my pussy is good? Yes, they be thinking they pussy What advice broken. do you give women about having better pussy? You gotta learn how to work your pussy yourself. There is not nothing that a man has done to my pussy that I have not done forwards, backwards, sideways, and around and around. Like, you got, like, think about it. If I was like, Carlos, you ain't doing, you know, I ain't getting her. You gonna be like, okay, what you want me to do? I don't know. That's not gonna work either. So it's like, if you know, if you know that you're not being satisfied, that's the first step and that's amazing. But are you gonna give them some direction? Like, you know what, I don't like this or I do like that. And are you with somebody that you can communicate with? Yeah, so that's, that's the first thing and the most thing. Before you even get to any of this shit, you got to communicate. It's so many people that have come to me, and they're, like, in marriages, and they're like, I've never had a nut in my marriage. I've been faking it the whole time. So some of them, they do find me, and they want to make a change. But how do you tell somebody I've been faking nuts the entire marriage or, like, I actually just always masturbate when you leave or... You really don't know what the hell you're doing, but you fine as fuck though, so, you know. Yeah. Like, how do you really say that? Like, these are real things. And I know for a fact there are so many men that women show up and they feel like because they showed up with pussy, that is good pussy. And that is exactly. absolutely not true. Right. Like, you that start fishing it. Some pussy ain't, it's just pussy. It's just. Just pussy? Just hey. pussy. Yeah. And so, it's like, are we. Some of that shit is. And we gotta Immaculate, communicate. Though. Some of it is. Is it what makes it good? What makes it what's what's good pussy? What makes pussy good? Yeah, what makes pussy good? God. God. <laughs> only only God knows what makes that shit good. We don't even know what's in it. The ingredients we, or none of that. It's just pussy. Pussy. It's, it's pussy? different. <laughs> it's just I don't know. I don't know. I feel like I feel like. We got to be able to accept some criticism. Right. And, and plus, a good owner, too. A good owner? Yeah, whoever owns that pussy. You could be, uh -huh. like, that's what really makes the pussy good. The good person owner. that owns it. This is a fact. Yeah. Like, but all that bad is... attitude and shit, that's the biggest turnoff, because it's like, that pussy got to be bad, because it's coming from a bad spirit. Negative energy make your pussy dry. That's exactly what I was trying to say, but you said it better. I got it on a shirt. You want one? I'm going to send it to you. I don't know if it'll come across if I wore 
because I'm on the other side. Negativity make your pussy dry. That's real. Then they'll say I'm misogynistic. That's the world we live in. So you you put me on here that shows that you're trying to be open to something different. I'm and like, like, I, I feel like education can take us so far. It can, honestly, I started this because I was like, there are so many relationships. You know how you seen people and they they cheating or whatever and shit goes bad, but you know they in love, but they are super unsatisfied. Right. I'm not. Yes, there's always other reasons. Some people just dog. Some people don't give a fuck. Da da da. And then we just gotta be real about it too. Some people just fuck a lot. So, okay, there, that's, there's that's that the facts. Too. Some people but what just what about the people that's like genuinely fuckers. unhappy? Like, I'm sorry, They're but fucking most... to fix that. That's <laughs> unhappiness fuck. It's called sexual essentials because it's all the essentials of sex. So exactly. if your mental not right, if you're not happy about what you got going on in your work life, like if you ain't got no hobbies, you ain't got no friends, like these are all the sexual essentials. Exactly, not but what if some, what these, if these are they hobbies? Shit. I mean, this could be a hobby. It's, it's a pastime for me. Yeah. I definitely wake up and catch three. You got to start the day off sunny. Now, how much would you say you have spent on sex toys in your lifetime? Well, before I met my toy vendor, a couple thousand, a few th about five stacks, maybe six. Damn. I'm not. I don't put cheap things on my pussy. I see. Yeah, so like these machines, so like I got I got myself a riding machine for my birthday. What, was, what does that consist of? It's a machine. You know how like they go to the uh, place and they ride the uh, the uh... mechanical bull. Yeah. You have one of those. It's small. It's about this size, and you get on it, and it has a dick, and it has a remote. You know, I like remotes. And then it moves, and you can sit on it, and it go. Mm -hmm. Yeah. And you can put this on your pussy too at the same time, and you can. Man, I'm a greedy bitch. Oh, this is the thing, though. A lot of people don't realize, like, a lot of women have never had a vaginal orgasm. To be clear, a vaginal orgasm is nothing more than a deeper clitoral orgasm. Okay? Yeah, I think this is stuff you should tell people before you start fucking them. Give you them a clap, give them an nah, intro you class. should just let them know, like, hey, don't even try hard. I ain't never really had no orgasm. Like, I'm not here to fix this pussy. What? <laughs> You're not here to give well, me Why would you? I'm just saying, if you ain't never had an orgasm before. Don't start with me. You know, like, <laughs> I'm going to fail like everybody else. What? You got to fail, though. I feel like when you really fuck with somebody, you really actually try. See, that's the thing. Most people really don't ask those questions. Or they ask one time, and then they do it. And they don't even talk about, like, so... Did you like this? It got kind of awkward. It got kind of quiet. Like, people not ready to hear those conversations. And then on the other side, like if, say, okay, so we talk about like how women, the pussy don't be ready or she don't orgasm, right? But what about when the dick be getting soft randomly, right? Don't nobody talk about that, it's just always awkward. I've gotten dick, good dick, after a dick got soft. First of all, I'm not gonna be awkward about it. Yo, man, my pussy was getting dry, we was going, I was like, you know what, let's take a break, because I felt that you was getting soft, it's all good. Like, you know what, I got some shit over here. We could try this, da 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 But being open to it and not being like, damn, why your dick got soft? Like, that's not gonna make it harder. Mm -mm. That's awkward as fuck, and I'm not calling you again. That's guilt. Like, that Probably that's... wasn't even supposed to be over there. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I'm just saying, when you give, when you treat people like people and just understand that a dick getting soft do not mean that he don't like you, he could be hella excited. Like, when niggas really like you, Sometimes they, they shit don't show up for the occasion. You know what I'm saying? And like your response right then tells you what's gonna happen. Cause you could just give them a second. Sometimes I be playing with my pussy and it don't go the way I think it's gonna go. And I just take a breather, you know, scroll the gram or something. And I go back into it, boom, just like that. Sometimes you just gotta give it a second. Okay. Be patient with the pussy. Exactly. Now that's the t-shirt you need. Yeah. Write that down. Let them know where they can find you at and why they can catch up on all these courses and catch classes. Catch up on all these and... things. All right, so you can find me on my website. Right. The sec the sexualessentials.com or on Instagram, sexual essentials, all one word. I have a Patreon where I have over 145 classes. Like, I'll teach you how to massage the dick, how to give a yoni massage, how to have multiple orgasms. I teach men how to have multiple orgasms. I teach you how to have an orgasm from breathing. Um, we do have multiple orgasms, most of us. Who, men? Yeah. No, y'all don't. You know when a man go to sleep, that's how I order the orgasm. Sleep? Sleep. I could teach you how to have multiple orgasms like women. So, 
There's a lot of different things. That shit probably kill you so fast. <laughs> Man, you, that's why God gave us one at a time. We don't need multiple. Then you have three back to back. Your you fucking be heart's about to stop beating. <laughs> But it don't last long enough for her to catch hers, too. Amen. It don't be lasting long enough. She got to um, start early then. All of that, you can find all that on my website or on my Instagram. That's what's or, up. Uh, yeah, so we do live teaching. Live teaching, no lecturing. No lecturing. No lecturing. I got classes on there where I actually have women that have volunteered, and I show you how to use these things on them. Word. Yeah, on the, I'm signing up. On the Patreon, I love yeah. a good story. I want to see yeah. some success stories. When I first signed up for the class, I mean, I was nothing. <laughs> but it wasn't nothing for real. <laughs> now I just wake up nothing. <laughs> I can't stand you. Look here, Since now. I bought my pussy machine, excuse my language. <laughs> <laughs> Look here, they be on there learning. We be having um, events. We got a live sex art show that's coming. It's a lot of stuff. I, I like showing people. Right. We now learn. Sum it all up for the fellas out there. Just, what would you tell the men watching this show? Be open to it. You Oops. probably do got good dick, but that don't mean that like it can't be better. Right. Elevate it. Get some demon dick in you. You know. Why? Why not? We that got one life to live. If I say about one your, car. You can't just be giving everybody your best dick. It's a hard well, then maybe you shouldn't be fucking him. I mean, there's some more dick in there. Don't give her that one. Uh -uh. Don't be giving sometimes people lack Sometimes men be giving, dick. sometimes we be giving our dick, we be like, uh-uh, don't give her that. Don't give her that. Don't give her that. Don't do that. Don't do that. Don't, do don't that. be giving make, out Make her think the dick ain't good. Make her think the dick ain't good, because she gonna act up. She gonna act up. Let me, see how, up let me anyway. see how she act with my C dick. Let me see. This ain't nothing but the C grade. This you know ain't... what? Then she hit you with that A-class pussy, and then you like, damn, I ain't come with my best guy. You gotta nope. stay ready. Nope. You ain't gotta get ready. I'm telling you. I'm telling you. All right, man. You out here <laughs> doing your best work. <laughs> now look at you. Now you need a whole goddamn dick with an air pump on it. <laughs> <laughs> ain't no way. That's you played with it? No, ain't no Let's way. Let's rewind the footage. You Man, had that in your head. I did. You had this. I you had got to, pussy coasters. I had to see the evidence. You a part of it. If we turn the this sound down, a, you look like an accomplice. This is a lot of shit. We just gonna start, like, right here. This is right a lot. Right here, you know, and one of these. That is, t uh, that is a lot of shit, man. It's some good naps. That's a lot of shit. Fellas, if your lady need all these toys to have a complete orgasm, just start focusing on yourself, man. <laughs> Work on your hobbies and shit. Get back, get back outside, my boy. <laughs> start back working out. Cut the yard more, man. Just get more active. Work on your truck. Work on your truck? Yeah, get back in the church, man. Is that what people do when they ain't getting no pussy? Because she need time to herself. To plug you, can her machine. <laughs> you can just get it to her for Valentine's Day. Bad boo, I got you a box of toys. Thank you. Bye. That'll be the saddest Valentine's Day in a nigga life. Nah, she'll be ready. <laughs> <laughs> you buy your girl one of these machines, bro. She just stop answering most of your calls. <laughs> I was using your gift, man. What you I doing? Was you. I was sleep. What? Really? So 17 times this week you've been asleep. I haven't seen you since your birthday, baby. What's that mode out here in the background? I should have never bought that shit. What's that out here in the background? A little motor going. Family keep asking about it. Where your girlfriend at? Oh, she's uh busy. <laughs> she couldn't make it. <laughs> I always show up. I just be late. If I was late, I was, I was masturbating. No, we know If I was what? late, I was just cause. Hey man. I was masturbating. Well, I appreciate you coming through here. This has been a appreciate very you. exciting talk. You have definitely brought some education, information, and some hilarity to the situation. You're always welcome here at The Trap. Thank you. The black market is open. 85 Shop Show. Samaya Brady. We out of here.